tiptoe, yeah. The In the club, got them bottles on replay. Trying to break a record like a DJ. What's going on, y'all? It's your boy TDK, and I'm bye, bye. Man, oh man, oh man, does it feel good to be back home, bruh. It feels so good to be back home in the sun, not really having to worry about getting the flu or nothing like that, not really worried about the uh, the rain and all that, you know. It feels good to be back home in California. I'm from Southern, Southern California, I'm from Long Beach, California, but I grew up in San Diego area a whole lot and whatnot. Either way it goes, I'm California made, California raised, you already know. Nonetheless, let's get into this game. See, the thing about this gentleman right here is this man, it, it, as you're going to see, as you see right here on the third and sixth, I dumped the ball down to my boy, Glitch Davis. He ends up getting us a first down. And right here on the first and ten, I get a ball to my dude, Adrian Peterson, and he's kind of just getting his way to the first down, making it look quite easy as I allow this hashtag fast break offense to continue to move up and down this field. And we get the ball to Adrian Peterson. He had a first down. Buddy end up getting tackled short. So right here on the second and two, what am I gonna do? First of all, you know it's not a Dream Kareem video if you do not see run commit. So I try to get a ball by boy Adrian Peterson. He didn't go anywhere. Right here on that third and five, I try to run it between the um the tackles and the linebackers, but I was one yard short. So you know what I do. I take my points and keep it moving because y'all know how I do. It's either hashtag sim style or get style on. And by the way, users oh day shout it. I do this defense for real home back with my brand new linebacker. Um Patrick Willis, talk about a brain fart. Y'all had the biggest brain fart there ever was with my dude Patrick Willis. And then on the very next play, my boy Eric Dickerson, he ends up getting in the end zone. And right there, he ended up blocking my kick. So I was like, you know what? For now on, it's it's basically a free-for-all. At this point, your ass is mine. And then while I'm thinking that, he gets a huge run on me. And my phone is going crazy, yo. Before I start, before I start this whole commentary, I actually had to redo this commentary because I was getting a call from Tanoka. Y'all know how Tanoka do. She be, Tanoka stay be in my commentaries, but she was calling me, so I had to restart the whole commentary because the phone call took a little longer than I thought it would. You know what I mean? I just lost my trade of thought. But right away, as he ends up getting a touchdown, I allowed my hashtag fast break offense to come back away, come back right away, and Randall Cunningham gets me a huge yard right here on that first and ten. Eric Dickerson he only got some five yards, but you know it's not an issue because I'm gonna take what I can get. Because you know what, this hashtag fast break offense, the unstoppable, it can be slowed down, but never stopped. The unstoppable hashtag fast break offense is going to continue to make moves. As you see us right here on the first and goal, I get a ball back to Eric Dickerson. And he's a regular bowling ball getting into the end zone. And you know I'm not done. I got to go for two because I'm trifling like that. Right here, I threw it in the back of the end zone. I thought I made a great read and a great pass. But it turns out it did not work out that way. So it's not an issue. We're going to go back to def playing defense. Basically, we're up by a score and a, a two-point conversion. So it's not really an issue. All we got to do is get a stop and hope for the best. But like I was saying, this gentleman right here, he has put in his braid that I paid for my whole team. And if... Like, come on, man. You would have to know. Clearly, I did not. Well, he doesn't know that. But clearly, he hasn't seen my update video. Because if he had saw my update video, he wouldn't know I do not pay for my team. You know what I'm saying? My team is too legit to quit. And then, of course, I got the best team on YouTube. Hashtag Trill Team. We are out here. And as you see him getting into the end zone and him going for two. But wait. My boy Patrick Willis said, no, no, not today. We are going to stop. You know, getting that two-point conversion as Randall Cunningham makes the pitch to my dude Jerome the bus Bettis. We do not get that far. We got less than 30 seconds, so I give the ball to CJ2K, my offensive captain, to be exact. Shout it. He ends up getting us a huge game, so I call a timeout. I give the ball up to my boy Eric Dickerson. I'm looking to get some yards, get some more yards, and I'm like, you know what? Should I call a timeout? Should I call a timeout? And then I was like, no, nah, let's go ahead. Let this hashtag fast break offense continue to go to work. 
as Eric Dickerson gets a first down and I jump out of bounds to play it safe and then I continue to let my fast break offense go to work and I try to let the bus just do his thing but he got stopped short so what I did was I just took my field goal and kept it pushing I said you know what we're going into the half with the lead it's not an issue so let's go ahead and play defense as you see right there on the first down he gets a huge gain first down and 10 he drops back throws the ball to his tight end gets another first down first down and 10 he drops back he's looking he's looking he throws an out route and my boy Patrick Peterson the combine warrior himself shouted. He ends up getting us an uh, interception, but he did end up getting injured on that last play, which was kind of whack. But it's not an issue because I'm allowing my hashtag fast break offense to continue to get to work as Eric Dickerson breaks a tackle and ends up getting us a first down. So right here on the first down and 10, I'm going to let this hashtag fast break offense continue to go to work, shouting as you see him just missing tackles. And I try to go out of bounds. But this gentleman, he was like, you know what? We're going to make sure we play a little dirty we're gonna play a little dirty today so he hit me with the late hit which was kind of like some ea cheese that they low-key gave to me but i'm not complaining at all because we end up getting a huge gain out of it and cj2k ends up getting the into and by the way get your fuck ass style on what Hashtag is he's my friend shout it. I'm just saying but look at CJ2K and you already know I'm gonna get my two points that I missed out on as I dumped the ball down as I checked the ball down to LaShawn Shady McCoy we go up and we get the two-point conversion as he's ready to get his offense going he gives the ball off to um Walter Payton and that, that dude is such a glitch but we did end up getting a nice little stop as you see me trying to strip the ball from behind but it did not work right here on the first and 10 throws the ball down and who better than Killer Cam all oh, y'all cats telling me to pass up on my boy Killer Cam y'all know y'all know y'all should be ashamed of yourselves telling me to pass up on Killer Cam Y'all really should be ashamed of yourself. Y'all know I'm not giving up on my boy, Killer Cam, as we end up allowing this ball. I mean, as I end up just continuing to allow the hashtag fast break offense to go to work, get, get, get it done. You know what I'm saying? We're looking to get into this end zone and put this clown away and let him know that the hashtag fast break offense cannot be stopped. It can only be slowed down for a little amount of time as I hand the ball off to my boy, Jerome. He gets hit with the stupid... Heat seeking tackle. Y'all know how the heat seeking tackling do. Y'all know how I be doing. As you watch me try to get the outside, it did not work. I'm just continuing to like, allow this fast break offense to do what it does. And right here, as I end up getting the touchdown, my boy Randall Cunningham. Y'all already know what happens. Do I really have to say anything? Do I really have to say anything? My man said, Kareem, you made your point. It's time to keep it moving. So you know how to let him know. You ain't got no pancake mix. You already know how to let him know. And you really think that run commit would have worked, though. Keep it real. I see it so much. Clearly, I know how to get around it. But like I said, he's going to send me a message. And y'all already know I'm hitting with the hashtag, last word, hashtag block. But it's been real. It's been true. It's your boy, TDK. And I'm out.